Assalamu alaikum and welcome to another episode of Real Talk with Riz Khan. And on today's episode of Real Talk with Riz Khan, I'm showing you a different hat that I wear. A hat that I've been wearing since I was 11 years old. And once again, I'm on the move. In this episode, I'm giving you some inside insights and a first-hand view at what it takes to present on live radio. Welcome to Real Talk with Riz Khan. The Asian Sand Ready Network Studios are right next to Strangeways Prison. So my car's parked up, there's a prison, and I'll show you our studios here. Welcome to Asian Sand Ready Network in Manchester. You just don't know who's listening and from where, which part of the world they're listening in, their story in life, but radio is uh, an escape. It's an escape for people from their routines, from their worries, but also to connect their hearts and minds in a different way. So there is so much history at the location and the place I'm currently at. It's the station where I spent over 15 years broadcasting. People have grown up with me. I've grown older with people. People have grown older whilst they've been listening to me. It's a huge family and that's the essence of radio. You become one huge listenership and one huge family. So I'm going to take you inside and give you a tour as I head into the studio. So when I first started radio, broadcasting, I would often spend hours in my day to prep my content and prep my show. But now, it just comes naturally. So over the years, I've trained many radio presenters who are willing and ready to find their voice. And one advice and tip I always share on radio is that just imagine that you are broadcasting and you're presenting to one person and that one person is your best friend. And what that advice allows you to do is connect at a more one-to-one, -one, a more personal level. And that really is a basic art and a basic skill of radio that will carry you through your career no matter how much experience you have. Right now I have something playing which means I've got a bit of a, a three minute break to get ready and to think about what uh, content is coming up next. But for me as soon as this mic button goes up something just happens in my brain. I just start speaking or waffling. So we are about halfway through my radio show. I'm just about to jump on air to do a link. Just after 8.20 on the clock from Manchester. This is Asian Sound Ready Network. And right now you're locked in to Evenings with Rich. And in this hour, it's, uh, it's called my brain break hour. It's your chance to declutter your eardrums, your mind, and to just get lost. It's all right to get lost sometimes. To get lost with these instrumental soundtracks. This one is by a group called Foreign Ensemble. It's uh, got a nice oriental vibe to this. I got plenty more instrumental vibes to help you declutter, to de-stress and relax in this sunshine coming out for you. For the very first time this year, I broadcasted one of my specialist radio shows, Iftar with Riz Khan, during the blessed month of Ramadan, live from Medina to Manchester, to the rest of the UK and worldwide. And that is an experience that I will cherish and remember and hold sacred for the rest of my life. And for those of you who listen and tune into the radio shows, a huge thank you to you as well. One of my favorite things about being on the radio is that you connect with people in all parts of the world, coming from all walks of life. And they each bring their own energy and their own vibe, perspective and insights to the radio show. For example, today I've had listeners from Canada in Toronto, from Pakistan, more locally. There are so many people, so many of you who tune in to support this radio show and have been doing for so many years. I'm entirely grateful to each of you for listening and supporting Evenings with Riz at the Asian Sound Radio Network. 
So my radio show is live right now, which means I'm kind of multitasking, doing the vlog and doing the radio show as well, connecting with thousands of listeners across the north of the UK, across the rest of England and worldwide as well. So from broadcasting at break times, I've got to play something now. There we go. From broadcasting at break and lunch times when I was in high school, to then moving on to local radio in my hometown of Rochdale and then spending over 15 years, over 15 years here at Asian Sound Radio Network. This is something that has been a huge part of my life, um, but I, I better get back on the radio. We'll connect again shortly. Surprise. A huge surprise for you as well. And I hope it's been a a good surprise for you though. So many of you have been in touch with the show tonight. In shock. Listening twice, three times. Turning up your radio speakers and volumes. <laughs> this is Riz Khan with you. Back on home soil. For some time during the summer months. And if I may share one more pearl, one more piece of advice for you, for anybody who's in the radio industry, anybody who's in the spotlight, anybody who's in communication in media, authenticity is so important. You have to be yourself and not somebody else when you're in front of the camera, when you're behind the microphone, because it shows. It shows in the connections that you build or that you don't build with your listeners or your viewers. Golden tip is to be real. Now, so many people enter the world of radio and they last a short period of time. There is so much room for everybody in this industry, but those who are in it for the long term, they have found their voice. They are humble and real and grounded, even in the spotlight. Above all, they can connect. They can connect with hearts, minds and souls of people with people from different backgrounds in different parts of the world. Honestly, it's like I've never been away. Manchester, the north of England, and our global listeners, thank you for your amazing company over the last couple of hours. As we head into the third and final hour of the show, the biggest lesson that I've taken away from my experience of my third international country is that Quite simply, the human race is one. We are one race. And sometimes we, we complicate matters far too much. More, more than they need to be complicated. It's nearly time. Three hours later, a live radio show done. Thanks very much for coming alongside and seeing a little bit about the behind the scenes of how we broadcast and how we present. There are so many listeners tuned in and messaging in on the show today because, well, it was a little bit of a surprise. Uh, as I'm back in the UK during the summer, I normally do some radio shows. So it was a great surprise for some of my regular listeners who have been tuned in and supporting over many years. And, and to you guys as well, thank you very much for coming along and seeing the behind the scenes and for taking note of some of my tried and tested tips, tricks and advice and wisdom on getting into radio, staying in radio and of course doing exceptionally well at communication, at broadcasting and of course getting your voice right. So the most difficult part of this job is keeping your voice, your energy fresh and alive for the thousands and thousands of people tuning in. As an example, today we've had listeners from the US, from Pakistan and from all different parts of the world where you'd never think people would tune in like Canada. There are so many amazing people in different parts of the world and radio is one form of media, one example that connects with people no matter where they are in real time and live. So we started the show with a little bit of daylight and now going to be driving home with a beautiful night sky in Manchester like this. So I hope you've enjoyed seeing me wear my other hat as a commercial radio presenter for the north of England's largest commercial Asian radio station. The reason I do, do radio, well, it makes me feel good. And if you can make others feel good on the inside in the process, it's a win-win. 
time now for me to drive back to my hometown. No matter where you are in the world, you can join me every Friday from 7 p.m. UK time until 10. Three hours of nothing but good vibes, brain breaks, and an escape from the usual worldly distractions and worldly routines. You can catch me back on the radio, Asian Sound Radio Network, every Friday, 7 p.m. UK time. Until the next time we meet, you look after yourselves. Mm -hmm.